Okay, uh, we're back. I uh, I took a nice shower, did the dishes. I'm all good now. So, we are two days shy of two weeks. Two days shy of two weeks left for spring. And we want to plow through it tonight, right now. So... What I'm going to do, since I have a shit ton of cash, I'm going to continue to save all my stuff. And we're going to we're gonna make a little note, a little list. Okay. So. This is good. I'm eating some of my beef jerky I made. Mm. So we want this completely filled up, completely done. So, shed, I don't know how to spell shed, S-H-E-A-D, that's not how you spell shed, autocorrect doesn't tell me in it either, so, shed, fully furnished. What's his name? Leaks. Leaks. His name's not Leaks. Leaks for George. For some reason, I was thinking it was Gregory. Um. Second house upgrade. Okay. Um. I think we're fine. I think our tools are fine. How much iridium? How much iridium do you think we should get? Ten bars of iridium. So, we're going to fully furnish the shed, get leaks for George, get the second house upgrade, and get 10 bars of Iridium. I think th those are some good goals. Goals we can complete. So... I was also thinking, get rid of this. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Because it would make more sense. Have it like that. Because essentially, you're taking two. The two that were here and making it into three. Oh, that's good beef jerky, though. Holy. Okay. that so as I was saying we're gonna do that we're gonna like put everything in here honestly I think either some if not most of this is shelf stable but it should be fine in the fridge for a week or two probably a week we'll, we'll probably have it eaten in a week Anyways, um, mm. okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my shit now. Another thing, uh, tree fertilizer, all right, mm. I don't even know how many animals are in this place, but 
Another fucking void chicken. Mm. You seem to like putting them right in front of the door. You good, man? Ruben? Yeah, you good. Okay. So we're gonna have this filled with fucking stuff, and we're just not gonna use it. Like, we're not gonna... Because what is it, 12 days? We have 12 days to get through. I want to see how much stuff I'll have after 12 days and the value of it. Just to show you, show you guys a larger value, a larger dollar value of how much the animals are bringing in. Okay. So, everything is sorted. I need to go to the mines, though. Well, I also need to make more of uh, more of these. On the bright side, it produces honey at all seasons, so yeah. We're gonna continue going for copper. Oh wait, Corey. We'll clean, we'll clean this out right now, and then probably, probably day 17, we'll come back here just to see how, how much it's filled up. Because in reality, this, this area, it's good whenever you first come here because everything is like completely empty, or it's, like, completely full. You know what? No, we're gonna wait for the last day. Like, we're gonna clean it out now. We're gonna wait for the last day. Clean it out again. And then, uh... We're not gonna come here at all for summer. Because I want to see... Ooh, I want to see how well it will uh, it'll refill. Cause if it's a if it's a seasonal thing that this place refills nicely, then rather than this becoming an occasional event, it'll become a seasonal event. Okay, we'll go to ten. You know the drill. We mine until we get a... A thing to mainly get stone. Also, we're gonna go purchase the second house upgrade. Tomorrow. There we go. Yeah, we mine stones until we get a way down, and then we rush through the rest of the thing, getting all the resources. Mainly because we want to get stone. Oh, sweet. You guys should give me iridium. That was kind of dumb. I'll go this way. Um.
Oh, hey, there's one right there. Okay. Anything else? Okay, we're good. This is why you don't explore it first. Plus, it could also be a giant straight line, so... Fucking A. So we don't even need to... Yeah. Okay. Nothing much. Nothing much in here. So I've discovered the convenience of, uh, you know, the, oh, I didn't even, I didn't even, god damn it. I've discovered the convenience of a tube of mayonnaise and squeezing it onto stuff rather than getting a freaking jar. Oh my god, it's life changing. You can call me, you can call me a weirdo all you want, but whenever I got my subway today, I, uh, I ordered online. I chose not to get, uh, mayonnaise. Because it, I find if, I find it freaking, uh, so makes the sandwich soggy if you don't, if you don't eat it right away. So, I think it was about half an hour from the time it was made to, well, the time they would have put mayonnaise on to, uh, when I put the mayonnaise on and ate it, and oh my god, it, it is so much better. It is so much better, okay? You guys, you guys can freaking look at me and be like, what the fuck, you weirdo. Yeah, no, it's so much better. If you don't believe me, try it. Also, also, hell, fuck it. Put in the comment section your favorite, uh, your favorite Subway sauce. What sauce do you put on your Subway sandwiches? Tell me. Cause I'm, cause I'm mayonnaise. I'm always mayonnaise. If, if they have light mayo, then I will go light mayo because I, I'm too heavy for myself. That sounded weird, cause it, it is weird. I'm too fat. That's what I meant to say. Even though fucking, two secret notes, man. God damn. Even though fucking, there's a possibility that. It may be worse for me than fucking regular mayonnaise. Oh well. I don't know. I don't care. The only the only benefit that I have is that where I live, the only good place to eat is fucking Subway. That's the only benefit I have. Like I can't blame I can't blame me being overweight on eating too much takeout because we have an A and W that's run poorly, a bar that's run by the same people who run the A and W, and then a sit down restaurant that I used to work for and I don't want to eat there. So yeah. Oh, we also have a fucking coffee shop, but I don't drink coffee, so I don't go there. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. The, uh, here I am fucking making beef jerky like a f fucking weirdo. I'm going to shut up and stop talking about myself now. Um... Yeah, I don't think I don't think we'll be fucking stopping or going to the top parts again. I think we're just going to keep starting at 20 because this has been a shitty run. Granted, we did get almost 200 stone from this and we have like three fucking 
I don't know where that is. Oh. Star Drop Saloon Special Order. Ah. If you can read this, come to Secret Wood, please. Bring my pal syrup. Okay, we need maple syrup, and we need to go to the sea. Oh, that's the bear! Ah, oh, that's the bear! Okay, okay, that's what we're doing tomorrow. We're gonna go see Mr. Bear. Also, those rocks that are lighter than the other rocks, fucking hit them. Because, uh, a lot more stone. Like, damn, okay. Okay, bring, bring my pal, bring my pal Sarap. Fucking love it. Uh, oh shit, 19's the fucking swirling one. Ah. So we're just gonna fucking break everything and go up. Yeah, so it seems to me that these lighter colored rocks always give stone and always like more than one piece. So, yeah. Break them rocks, Bobby boy. I, th I have a feeling I'm going to pass out. Oof. Yeah, I think I ate too much today. Because I had leftover ribs. I need, I need to make, I need to have a better diet. Because literally, I had leftover ribs. I had fucking beef jerky and a Subway sandwich. As well as leftover salad from yesterday. I need to get like a fucking fruit or something in my, in my, in my diet. Also drank way too much Gatorade. So probably probably my fucking sodium intake is way too bad. Also, I'm probably going to fucking pass out in here. Oh my god, I'm going to pass out in here. <laughs> oh shit, run for it. Run for it. Oh, we're going to it's going to be a bad day tomorrow. We're going to not have enough fucking thing. But anyways, we're going to go we're going to go deliver maple syrup to our bro that asked for it nicely. Suck it, bitch! Ha-ha! <laughs> okay, let's go. Do, 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 do. You know, I remember whenever I was so fucking optimistic that I was going to get all the leaks in one week. And then... I happen to sell half my or all my all the leaks I collected. Imagine what kind of bozo sells all his leaks. <laughs> okay. We're getting a good, good amount of stuff. Hmm. Nice. Yeah, I'm just going to toss all the rest of this in there. Oh. Oh, we'll, we'll grab, we'll grab our, uh, our, our daily shit.
You know what I wonder? I wonder if they're like fucking if they're if they're actually eating. Or if they're eating from in here because the stuff is so far away. I really hope that's not happening. If it is happening, we'll move the barn down here. Go ahead and check our thing. Cause we should be we should be close to, if not at one hundred by now. We got maple syrup right there for our buddy. They are fucking eating it! God damn it! It's too far away. That's why they ran up north. Fuck. Okay, okay. We got everything out from this chest, right? Yes, we did. Okay. Motherfucker. Way to ruin my fucking day. Oh, this is eggs. I'm dumb. That's all she wrote for eggs. Okay. I need a fucking horse. I need I need a horse. I need iron and I need fucking hardwood. We're going to get her to start produce making making my fucking horse. I also need to make sure to move. Sweet. Three leaks. Thank you. Thank you, RNG gods. Anyways. My head hurts now. Can I, like, block? I could block that. Hmm. Honestly... Get this area set up. Get this area set up for the trees. We'll cut it off from here if we can. But if this is all grass... Figure out how much we can get in here. If we can get... If we get can get four, we'll see how far we can get down to here. We'll see how much we can get between the two. And then we will completely cut off the upper farm from the lower farm. Have cows here. We can probably bring this down more. Cows over there. Chickens and shit. Our, I didn't want... God damn it. Because I don't want this. I don't want this like this. Like... Thank you. 
Because this was perfect right here. But now it's not. Fuck it. I spent 29 minutes on the first fucking day. I'll put it right there. No, no. We're fucking... They better not have moved into that area. The pig is fucking moving. We're leaving it there. We're leaving it there. We're making more grass. Okay, that's not what I wanted. Oh no, this is the second day. Never mind. I was gonna say twenty some twenty some minutes on the on the fucking first day. <sighs> Game's gonna be the death of me. So Grass seeds a hundred gold, right? Pierre, you son of a bitch. I have a cow problem. I hope you can help me. Mainly because I don't have the fiber to build to make all of them. Because I had, I think I had 750 and I turned them into 75. And I put them up above for me to fucking farm them. But. Since the motherfucking cows, my pig, my goats, and sheep decided to eat all of them, I am now here. Watch that goat. Even the rabbits are fucking eating him. So. Okay. All of this better not get fucking eaten. We're gonna go do something over here. And we're going to do something up here. I want to see if this stuff will grow on this grass area like this. Because if it will, then we have more real estate for this stuff. But we're still going to work on getting all of this done up and make made into trees so we can push everything over. Ooh. It's a harvest day. Yeah, so good thing. Good thing we didn't plan on going anywhere because we have a bunch of stuff to fucking do. So we are getting some sunflower seeds, which is good. Um. Nothing. 
Nice. So six plus six, that's 12. So we had 16. We're going to use those to make more seeds. We are going to go ahead and plant the one seed that we need. And then we'll put the rest of the seeds in the thing that it needs to be in. Because that way we have a full set of seeds plus we have backup. Pretty sure that's kind of what I'm going to start doing. Okay. Uh, the potatoes, they should be done in a day or two. Did I, I, I don't think I brought some of that up there, but I do see quite a huge chunk taken out. I did not mean to do that. So if you want to move an animal to a different thing, you just walk right up to it. I got it. I got it. Uh, so we have a horse going in. Okay. Put those in there. Put that in there. We're going to go to the secret wood. We're going to fix up these chests, too, soon. You know what? Organize, baby. I need that. One more milk. So that's all our goat milk and majority of our eggs are done up. Right? Yeah. I need a loom. I need a couple looms. Uh. Put that in the chest. So she should be walking home now. If you can read this, come to Secret Woods, bring maple syrup. So we have maple syrup. I think we're just going to go there right now because I'm pretty sure she stays at home the rest of the night or she goes to the pub. So we'll do that. You have no idea how pissed off I'm going to be if those animals continue. Yeah, see the bear I was talking about. He speaks to us. The smell. Come closer. <clears throat> also, I'm going to start fucking talking. Huh. It's not every day I get to speak to a human. Looks like you've got a little force magic in you. Now, about my note. Did you bring me the good stuff? The smell. This is the real. This is the real sweet stuff. It's my favorite sauce. It makes me very happy. And horny. You've made a friend today, Bob Ross. <laughs> I 
I got something special I want to show you. <laughs> it's his penis. The bear left you with his special knowledge. Salmon berries and... <gasps> what? Oh, damn! Why they do that to me? So these, so each fucking berry is worth 30 now. Oh, why do they do that to me? And, and, and blackberries. Oh my fucking god. Blackberries are gonna be amazing. Oh, mother. Goddamn, Mr. Bear. I'm glad I can say I got diddled by a bear. I shouldn't say that, but... Yeah, I said it. I got diddled by a bear. Fuck yeah, I'll be there. Um, I got diddled by a bear. Let's go see Haley and tell her I got diddled by a bear and he gave me the incredible, the incredible gift of the gab. And my salmon berries are now worth more. He showed me his salmon berries. <laughs> uh, so... Ten berries is three hundred, so a hundred berries is three thousand. Fuck, dude. We might not even be able to give her the sunflower today. We have to get all the fucking berries. No, we don't. We're gonna. We're just gonna straight up head 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 to. Head home now. We'll head home after we give her the sunflower. But fuck off, Mr. Bear. Why couldn't you did the, why couldn't you diddle me earlier? Eh beautiful How are you? I decided I'm going to organize my clothes today. I'll have to throw out all of last year's styles to make room for new ones. Oh god. Have a sunflower. Is it as simple as... No? Okay, so we have to go to the beach tomorrow. That's her next thing. Fucking... Tripled the value. This is why... This is why certain... Certain perks are kind of... Overpowered. Like, getting... Getting purple starred items for every foraging item, it's kind of messed up. Also, we are getting a lot more fucking leaks than uh, we were planning on. So we're probably gonna friggin... We'll have enough. Ooh. Yeah, I don't feel good. That bear went down the wrong pipe. Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck. Holy moral. Look at this. Look at this! Those fucking mushrooms are worth 300 apiece. What? Okay, okay. Salmon berries, they're not worth 30. They're worth 33. My bad. My bad. That's quite a lot, though. That, like, we got 5,000 gold just from foraging items. And we had a miniature harvest day. Okay. 
She's still working on it. Okay, before we go anywhere. Why, hello. Oh, sweet, we got blackberries, so we'll be able to see how much the blackberries are worth. Because come fall, we're, if I remember. If I remember. <laughs> come fall. Uh, yeah, if I remember, we are going to be... Uh, we're going to be farming. We're going to be running after blackberries, man. Yeah, there's nothing really else to do in here, so we'll just leave that. Okay. 38 pieces of hay. They're staying strong. One more and those will be done. I'm pretty sure I put down more... Uh, more uh, potatoes there. I think I may need to purchase even more grass seed. Just to fill up this whole area and in front of the barn. Because they just ate all of this within two days. I'm starting to wonder now if... If it's... If I should just either sell some animals... Or, or I'm gonna have to go ham on the, on the fucking hay, or not hay, wheat, whenever the time comes. <sighs> Ten grand. Ten grand. Ten grand for one hundred for one hundred things. And that might not even feed them for a couple days. Well we'll see how how this all turns out though, once this is uh once we sell all this in the season. Because we'll have to buy, like, every after every winter, we'll have to buy, like, I don't know, a couple hundred. Just set it up for us to fucking farm to get hay for the winter and to freaking... Yeah, because right now, right now, we're, we're kind of fucked. That scared the shit out of me. But that was my phone going on Do Not Disturb for the night. Um... Yeah, this is going nice. Like, this up here, it's going perfectly. I cannot say the same for over here. I know we have this big patch here, but I know none of them have been going all the way down here. The thing that I don't know ex exactly is how much... Is how much it grows on actual grass and if it just grows on this stuff. But likelihood is the dudes just come out, eat as much as they can, and then just walk around the rest of the day. Like if I would leave that gate open, they would all go up north to eat. Okay. Um. We need to take a look at our list. So... Fully furnished. We have the leaks are getting there. Uh, we're going to be getting the house once that horse is built. Tree fertilizer. So fiber and stone. If there was a place that I could purchase fiber, I would. I could make 19. We've made 19. We're going to cut down the trees. We're going to keep that in our inventory. OK. 
Okay. Okay, we have to plant them. Plant them, then fertilize them. Oh, we can... F we can do that. That's nice. So we can fertilize them. Okay. So all the ones over here are fertilized. Okay. Honestly, that was six trees and we have 57 hardwood. No, 66 hardwood from... So we got 74 from eight trees. That's kind of good. And we have mo the majority of them fertilized now, so... Yeah. Uh... All of our reserves are depleted. Looms. What do we need? We need fiber. We need fiber. Okay, we already gave her her two gifts for the week. We're going to go get fiber. We have our golden hoe, and we will go and get, or not golden hoe, golden scythe, and we will go and get har, har, fi, har, har, bar, bar, fiber. Oh, hey, she's here on Fridays. Bruschetta. Roasted tomatoes on crisp white bread. Our lady friend likes coconuts, and we need a rare seed. Grab a coffee bean, too. You disappoint me. I was hoping that you would sell fiber. So we have uh, two more days to go through, and then we have another week to do. As it stands, we're not making good timing. Because I want to have it done in three hours. It's not. If we can get the tasks we have set out for us done, then we're just going to brute force the days. Like, I'm hoping we can get uh, Haley as our girlfriend before before the spring dance, but I doubt that's going to fucking happen. She's probably going to dance with fucking Sam. We'll kill Sam eventually. <laughs> We don't even have enough for a fucking loom yet. This is what I get. This is what I get for deciding to make tree fertilizer. Also, why does it need f why does it need fiber like require gold? 
or something. Please. Imagine going mining just to get fiber. That's what we're going to have to do. We have enough for one loom. That's it. Let's go make that loom. And then start doing our shit. Uh, I think tomorrow's a harvest. If it is, we'll start production on making potato seeds. Imagine if I would have thrown that in there. <laughs> uh, put that in there. Well, we did get our fucking stuff back from, uh, from that one, so. Make two of those, I guess. Um. We need more cheese presses. Um, I think we'll do it like this. Like that, and then have it essentially cut off right here. And then we can make a line of stuff. It's going to look weird, but I don't care. we could have a line of fucking chests but yeah uh, we need to purchase more of those for that section I need to find out where the rest of the there they are because that you can go up there like that and then that and that are done up Yeah, the thing we have to think about is what are we going to put right here? I think we'll just leave it open. But anyways. um, So charcoal furnaces are fine. We'll need to purchase some more wood chippers. Uh, cheese and mayonnaise presses are our problem right now. And furnaces. Because we need stone for all of it and then copper ore rather than anything else for the other shit. So. Go to sleep. Yeah, blackberries. 120. Damn. 120. I didn't screw that on correctly. Okay. Two more days. Two more days and then we go for seven. Um. Apparently weeds have caused damage to my farm. Let's fucking see. Oh. Fuck off.
Yeah, we'll continue to make regular chickens, too. So we're going to have to keep checking the thing over here, the silo. So we're sitting at a nice 60. We're sitting at a solid 60. Oh shit. Setting out a solid 60. Uh, we'll check again tomorrow. And we're just going to have to keep checking it until it's no longer 60. Because the moment it's no longer 60, we have to rush to fucking Pierre's to get, to get some of it. Grover? Fucking Grover. Let's do this. I probably can't rename Grover. I probably can't even rename Grover. Whatever. Uh, where are we going, Grover? Let's go back into the shed. I need all that. What happened to all the wood? Oh, right. We made stuff, right? right dude fucking kegs man everything out here needing stone and kegs are like hey get me some oak resin copper and iron and we can call ourselves fucking solid yeah oil makers oil makers are the pain in the ass though hardwood fucking cheese presses hardwood so yeah no wonder we lost 100 hardwood Although, these trees are growing fast, which is nice. Excuse me. Ex there we go. Thank you, Doge. Thank you, you bitch. He probably hates me anyways. Fucking Grover, he's a horse. His name is Grover the horse. Okay. Oh, right, we were going to the mine. Rice shoots. Nice. I don't think we can grow rice shoots in the, uh, in the place, the place where we grow things. We said we were going straight to 20. Okay, that's good.
Okay, let's delta. Fuck you, fly. Okay, we're good. gonna need fucking yeah. so I don't think we're gonna be going down to get uh, that stuff anytime soon because we need we need the place done up before we can start uh, we need we need the whole fucking shed done up before we can start going all the way down so we may not make our uh, our iridium quota but I think we'll move it down. Like we'll uh, we'll ha we'll make ourselves a quota of uh, ten per season, and then add an extra one off of to each. Add an extra one for each. I don't know week. You know, no. Let's make let's make the quota five for this for the rest of this season. Okay. Next season the quota will be ten iridium bars. Okay, it's right there, so we just have to go up and check here. Because if we didn't need stone as bad as we do, this whole area would be going a lot quicker. Honestly, I should have bought a shit ton of stone before starting spring, but yeah, I didn't. You know what, let's turn this around. Let's fucking... Let's go ahead and just plow through these things and hope we get good. Because we have another, another stone node now, essentially, that we know of. Sneakers? Wow. Uh, it's written in Leah's handwriting. My idea of the perfect date would be salad, goat cheese, truffles, and wine for dessert. For dessert, I'd need a poppy seed muffin. Yum. If someone gave me one of those things, I'd melt. I hid something behind the community center. It's a body. We'll fucking check that out later. We'll check it out tomorrow. How much we've gotten twenty five? It's not very good. Did we find... Yeah, we did find one up here. Okay, we are getting a lot more now.
how is our stone? 148. If we can get 200 per, uh, per expedition, I think we'd be fine. Also, uh, we're not going... I don't plan on building any more barns or coops for the time being. I may end up actually selling animals eventually. Because if we can get our ancient fruit production off the ground and straight into wine, in, into wine barrels, then we'll be set for life. Because the only reason we are doing animals is because we need money and we need money now. And at current standing, I think we're fucking bringing in a ton of money. Because if we get to the point where we are bringing in ex extra fucking stuff and we don't have the barrels for them, then... Because essentially for the ancient fruit, two sets of sneakers. Wow. Okay. Essentially what we want is we want the final upgrade to the house to get the cellar to get those, uh, the aging barrels. Because once we get those, then the way the life of an ancient fruit goes from, it goes from off the vine into a, into an, a, uh, wine barrel. From there... It'll go into an aging barrel once done. It'll get aged till it's purple starred and then sold. But we're not going to do that for all of our wine because the aging process is a lot longer than it takes to grow the ancient fruit and then age it or and then make wine out of it. A aging it to fucking iridium class, it takes forever. fuck did we just pick up dark sword it has the vampiric i'm assuming that's enchantment less damage it has less damage it's it's one level lower it does less damage less speed higher well crit chances compared to crit weight but the thing is, it's vampiric. So we're going to fucking test this thing out. Come on. I think it's a load of garbage. I think it's a load of garbage. Yeah, we're going home right after we were done here. We may die. I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. What'd we lose? Hey, Linus. What'd we lose? Five thousand and two items. The dark sword and mushrooms. Thank God! <laughs> Let's leave. Let's leave while while the getting's good. We've only lost five grand. A shitty sword and mushrooms. Oh yes. Right?
Is that all we lost? Yeah, that's all we lost. I think. Oh, the misery. Oh, I'm a bumblebee. A bumblebee that likes to eat KFC. I have escaped death once again. Well, I've... I didn't, I didn't escape death. I escaped tragedy. Hello, Emily. Yes, it, I've been doing great. What do you want? So, you've been here a while, I'm sure. Oh, she's gonna make clothing! Yeah, um. Blah, blah, blah. We can now use Emily's sewing machine. That's because we made cloth yesterday. Okay. I really want a plate of sushimi. I really want you to shut the fuck up. We don't always get our wish. Who? Who does Horton hear? Horton hears a who. A me? No, a who. Nice. I just realized we had the what was left of our hardwood on us. That could have ended really, 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 really bad. Okay. But it didn't. We're alive. They're hanging out up front again. And all of it has been eaten back to here. Oh my god. You guys kill me, you know that? Oh shit, there's a panning opportunity. Out of my way, Gogo. -Go. Out of my way, Scrooge. There we go. Yes, copper. Honestly, we're probably going to sell our fucking... We'll probably sell our sheep. We'll probably sell our sheep, get another rabbit. S keep the, the properly named goats. Because they're just going to keep eating, man. They're just going to keep eating and we're going to run out of fucking... Like, yeah, we're, they're bringing in money. Like, I'm pretty sure they're paying for what they're eating. But that's the thing. We don't want them to pay for what they're eating. We want them to be self-sufficient. Like, to make us a shit ton of money without costing us too much money in the long term. Fucking cows, man. I was going to say, no wonder John Marston hates cows, but no, that's the wrong, that's the wrong thing. No wonder John Dutton fucking gets mad about his land. What are these? Oh, they're garlic bulbs. Right, because we planted garlic. Yeah, I'm not seeing I'm not seeing the the stuff grow on here on grass. 
so... If that's the case, we are going to have to move this plot of land. I mean, we could get one more harvest out of it. We did spend... What was it? 400 sap on this? We'll get one more harvest out of this. We're going to go ahead and... We can either make the seeds... Or we can just go ahead straight up and purchase them. 200 seeds at 50 a piece. I need my phone for a second. Ten thousand. We haven't even seen the we haven't even seen the profit value of this yet, so ten thousand. I'd say fuck it, because that's what we've been spending on the fucking cows. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's, let's go ahead and make another harvest. Unless Okay, we're gonna bring all of this stuff. Well, not all of our stuff. We're gonna we're gonna stop off at the at the shed, and we're going to put all our animal products into the things, and then we're gonna go to Pierre. Ask Pierre what's worth more, garlic or potatoes, and then we're gonna fucking go from there. Cause how many potatoes did we get? I need math for that because that's three rather large numbers. Eight six plus eight three plus nine one. It's two sixty, not counting the ones that we already harvested. So we get about one point six potatoes per thing, I th I think. Okay. Yeah, one point six potatoes per thing, roughly. That's my rough mathematical equation. Because then we're going to start looking at value. A value for animal products, that is. Because uh, if it turns out that cows aren't worth more than chickens, I might literally just derelict my... Oh, hey, it's... We'll talk to her, and then we'll fucking... Go to see Pierre, grab the shit from him, run back to the place, come back here to give her a sunflower, and then, yeah. Okay. Pierre. You kind of fucked me with those. You don't tell me the exact pricing. And if it was for potatoes, I'd need to know now. So... Garlic is about 10 gold less than potatoes. Fuck it. We'll, we'll go potatoes. 
grab 200 of them. Ah, we'll grab 240. 220. 240. 250. We'll grab 250 of them. We have cash. Might as well. Like, we're not worried about... If we were worried about days, we would have went with garlic. If we were worried about cash, we would have went with parsnips. But we're fine for cash and we're fine for time to get the potatoes. So we're going with potatoes. I have a lot more stuff to worry about than what the fucking plant right now. I think this was this is so far the longest one shot episode that I've done with no cuts. It's also probably the most infuriating episode I've done. Finding out my cows are literally eaten like pigs. But in the end it's going to be worth it because we're going to have a shit ton of cash at the end of this. Um yeah, so we'll have some potatoes left over. And we need to keep taking a look at this to make sure that it grows. Because if it's not growing, then I don't even think that the stuff for the for them is growing. Because, yeah, it doesn't look like it's growing. Nice. Um, we're going to put some garlic in there because I don't think we have garlic. Let's check this stuff. Nothing. Um. Yeah. I did not want to do that. Okay. Let's grab all the milk. That's two. Mm -hmm. okay, so we have a bunch of that stuff to sell. I didn't put the potatoes where they should have went. Or not the potatoes. The seeds where they should have went. So potatoes did return on their profit very nicely. Because that's almost triple the profit and not counting the potatoes that we already harvest. So that is triple the profit. Uh, Garlic, on the other hand. Then again, it's two days shorter and 10 gold less. So those projections... I'd say they're kind of good. Like it's not the uh, it's not the quantity that we've made with the potatoes, but the potatoes are also per also there's a chance to produce more than it's standard. So I think probably the most profitable thing is fucking potatoes because you can get you can get two harvests 
of uh, cauliflower. Okay, 32. Remember that number, 32. Thirty-two plus sixty is ninety-two. Okay. Okay. Potatoes are looking nice, and all this stuff is done. So guess who gets their fucking thing? We'll also do that. I know they're gonna be like it's Monday, six days to grow, so we should get them Sunday. Actually, I think what we're going to do here, plant potatoes, plant potatoes, yeah. I have to go see my stuff because I need to make I need to make 30 more seeds. So that's 3 of each item. Okay, we got 17, so that's good. Actually, Just to cover that. Did I even fucking grab the other stuff? Probably not. down these trees and replant them once we yeah because we didn't grab these so I think what we're going to do is we're going to what I want to do okay we're going to cut everything down except the ancient uh, ancient seeds and fucking potatoes because we're just going to keep using the seed maker to make potatoes Also, yeah, I'm pretty sure that uh, we're gonna need we're gonna need fucking seeds and shit. We're gonna need grass seed. We're gonna purchase another ten thousand today, thanks to potatoes. Because right now we need to, we're hoping to get to the point where we are pulling in ten thousand a day from animals alone. Once that happens, I don't give two fucks how much these dudes eat. The only thing I am gonna care about is how much hay I can produce before winter. Because what will screw me over is fifty gold per animal a day. That is what will screw me over in the long term. But if I can get if I can get a full house of animals straight up get a full house of animals fucking get loaded on everything and ev anything and everything that is needed will be will be set. 
Pierre wants some sashimi. Ev Evelyn wants a leek as well. Okay, I need one more leek. If I would have known that, I would have had it. That field of potatoes looks absolutely beautiful. The thing is, if it cannot produce more than our animals, then there's no point in having it. You know what I'm saying? We're here looking for mushrooms. Common mushrooms aren't worth shit. Give me the moral and murder of slimes. Because we need a sweet... Oh, right, right. Find out where our sweet gem berry is, because we're going to have to plant that too. I forgot to say uh, I forgot to do the thing, so uh, we're just gonna continue onwards with this with this day, and then hopefully I remember. If I don't, we're just gonna keep going. Cause we're currently at an hour and a half, and this is day seven. I think. And we're looking for a leak. Spring onions would be good, too. No spring onions. Uh, probably going to be the last time we come down this way. Ooh. One piece of gold ore. It's kind of garbage. Oh, shit. Hey, beautiful. You're welcome. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be dancing with her. Yeah, so the sewing machine, if you get a piece of cloth. Where am I going? Right. To this house. You get a piece of cloth, you get a random item. And then you you get a piece of cloth, random item, and then you go to the thing, and it'll make a specific piece of clothing. What else can we do? Hey, I'm going to invite some friends over to do a rock rejuvenation ceremony. But, um, okay, okay. Literal rocks. But I need some crystals to channel the right energy. Do you think you can lend me a hand? Or go fishing. F okay, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna help her lend, give her a hand. So, literally, we're gonna fucking go home right now and do that rock rejuvenation thing. Hey, Evelyn! Okay, so, tree fertilizer's done. Uh, five bars of iridium. We've given George the leaks. And we've upgraded the house. So, over the next six days, we are going to be working on the shed and getting Iridium. Okay, let's, let's just grab all this. Okay. 
honestly, I don't think we'll be able to do it. Not, not from lack of trying, but getting enough stone, getting enough copper, and all that, that's just going to be a pain in my ass. So, we're going to do our best. Okay, what, what the fuck does she need? She needs ruby, topaz, emerald, jade, and amethyst. So, Jade, Ruby, Topaz, Amethyst? Pretty sure that's everything. Yeah. Rock rejuvenation. Fuck. Honestly, that that request confused me to all hell. This isn't where I needed to go. Wait, this is where I need to go. Hey, Pierre. I'm like I'm like gonna put Abigail through college or some shit with the amount of money that I spend here. You know, I'm glad I'm at the point where I can spend 10 grand and I feel nothing. I love this game. And there that and there she is. Hey. Have I told you Haley and I are sisters? Strange, isn't it? Yes, it is. You dye your hair. A thousand a thousand gold for that. Three stars. Okay. <laughs> Sup, Gus. I would like a fucking beer because I need to get hammered. We'll get that too. Yes. Give me, give me a bunch of beer. I want to get hammered. They should make they should make that fucking stack though. They should really. Like I shouldn't be dry I shouldn't be riding a horse right now. But hey, it's a fucking video game. Also, it it was five o'clock for us. Right there, so yeah. Okay. Let us give these fucking bastards more food. Okay, that was a hundred. That was a hundred we filled up. So it would take about 250 to fill up this whole area. Okay. So guys, please like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll continue to make a dosh in this game. What is this achievement for? Living large. Upgrade your house to maximum size. Guess what? It's not it's not the maximum size. We still need to make the cellar. So we're gonna tomorrow, next day in this, we are gonna go see uh Robin again. See what we need for it, how much it is. It's probably a hundred grand. Hundred grand more hardwood, stone, regular wood. The whole nine yards. We'll also take a look and see what we can what else we can purchase from her? 
Because I know we can purchase a fish pond. I've never done those before. But, yeah, we'll go see if we can get uh, get a sturgeon or something for it. Anyways, we'll be back in a second. Mm -hmm. 